So welcome back after a very very long break. I will use this um, quite short video to briefly explain where we left off and why we left off more importantly. Um, we have roughly stopped doing our videos or written on our website in June, July 2018 and uh, you should know that in July we had more than one project going on actually. We have not only worked on the garden renovation but we have also decided to tackle the rest of the house renovation and that turned out rather difficult and time consuming, definitely more than we expected. Um, we decided to take down a load bearing wall and uh, needed structure engineer and house builders to help us complete the task obviously and after many many complications and after the builders left we had a hall of downstairs to paint we also did some uh, wood floor sanding on our own and obviously varnishing afterwards we also had a part of um, floor to lie with the new wooden floor and um, there was also some sanding and oiling of our kitchen worktops so there was lots and lots of going on and even though throughout the whole time we had people helping us uh, working on the garden and, and working in the house um, we tried to keep track of uh, what was going on in the garden but that was getting harder and harder saying all of that we were still recording for some time after stopping publishing further videos and then we also have many photos so it's something that um, we will try to upload with time and obviously update our website as well but all of that you know it doesn't mean that the garden renovation is over we took a small break in july uh, but we completed a big part of the project in august for example um, we again had um, another brilliant person helping us in the garden in November 2018 and we reached another very important milestone and then we took a break in January now 2019 and we are back in the garden now in February working at the very back of the garden and to be honest we are hoping to finish before summer Obviously that was the goal last year, but that was very unrealistic. So now you're just watching a small catch up from uh, me trying to tackle a third step in the garden, but I'm actually more interested in um, showing you what we did back in June, July, which was um, having a go at creating our sitting area, which didn't quite turn um, the way we wanted. Looking at it now, there is very few things that turn out the way we want it, <laughs> but uh, I think this is a material for a totally separate video and something that we will probably publish at the end. So this is Guillaume making a circle for our sitting area. It was meant to be 150 centimeters from the center to the edge, meaning three meters across. I thought this would be a good time to disturb Guillaume drawing his circle and explain what is it that he's uh, drawing or what is it that sitting area is. Um, it's an um, area made out of paving slabs, so pieces of slabs we found in our garden throughout the garden renovation that we want to create in order to be able to sit somewhere comfortably in a garden because this is a very very sunny spot at least during summer and it's somewhere to put table and at least four chairs around it where we can have our lunch or dinner or simply invite our friends and have someone to sit at while we're having barbecue for example or instead of a table we can always put their fire pit and chairs around it. Just a view on our sitting area. I seem to be missing something there. 
Um, so we've actually, I don't know if I recorded anything at all, but we've actually properly measured that as to what would be the comfortable um, seating, let's say, uh, square meter over like a circle because we will try to make it into a circle now because the earth fell all over you know just you cannot tell anymore but this used to be a circle and it's actually 300 centimeters across which is quite much larger of what i expected it to be however we put the chair uh, sorry we put the table in the middle we put four chairs around it we accounted for people sitting at the table we accounted for people um moving their chair out uh, to stand up or just sort of sit comfortably by the table but not at it actively and it seemed like a um, great uh, the, the, the answer to our problem was um, 150 centimeters from the middle of the table um, so obviously the, the circle, like I said, is three meters each side, which left us with very, very little uh, space around it. Space around it would be probably um, grass, which obviously we'll have to wait till next spring. Um, here I am uh, growing some seedlings. I will try to, well, if the seedlings don't die, I will try to plant a um, flowers that will sort of go I think 90 centimeters up so hopefully they will be leaning nicely against the mm, fence and the rest rest will be just a grass like I said